I'm Amos Neumann. I, am, um, I work for Armosa Formats, which is a uh, development and distribution company for TV formats based in Tel Aviv, Israel. And what are TV formats? This is a very complex question because there's a lot of difference between a format and a TV show. Many, many things can be TV shows, documentaries for example. There are TV shows and not necessarily formats. Formats are, are TV shows that can be repeated and done in a different way uh, in different countries and with different cultures. And you sell TV formats all over the world? We sell TV formats all over the world, yes. So give me a couple of examples of very successful TV formats that Armosa has done. Okay, for example, um, our Shiny Floor uh, primetime entertainment show called I Can Do That, which is basically an uh, entertainment show in which eight celebrities are watching every week um, unique talent acts, and they need to step down the stairs and say, I can do that. And until the next week, they have a week to learn these acts and perform them in front of live audience and get voted. Nobody gets eliminated. They all work together. The unique talents teach the celebrities how to do their acts, and therefore when they get money, the money is split between them. Um, so we're having a very fun show. Celebrities are shown uh, their uh, abilities outside the box or outside their usual behavior. Fun show, yeah. And you've sold a, a TV format into um, Ghana and Tanzania. Yes, Tell me we about have. That. Yes, we have. It's actually our first uh, production in Africa. Um, the show is called The Package. It is a factual entertainment show in which a person um, is, giving, is given a package from somebody that he hasn't seen for a long time and has some emotional connection to him. Um, he gets the package, he tells the story. In the meantime, the sender also tells the story. And then uh, the receiver is giving another package to somebody that he thinks deserves it, um, somebody from his life. Yeah. And Viasat bought this show, and are they doing it uh, in two separate versions, or are they doing it in a version which it's we go one ver It's one version that is being uh, broadcast in Ghana and Tanzania. You've had a circumstance in Africa where somebody has, in a sense, stolen one of the ideas. Tell me about that. Um, well, stolen is a harsh word, yes. but um, I would rather call it uh, being deeply influenced by uh, <laughs> the creativity <laughs> of our formats. <laughs> And this happens basically in places where um, TV culture is young. Yes. And, and people think that they can learn from things that were done in the world and copy them. Yeah. Um, which, is, which is not a um, professional behavior in our standards. Meaning, um, when you want to acquire a format and create it in your country, you need to buy the rights. Yes. Because this is a matter of intellectual property, IP, which is important for the creators and for the distributors as well. And what do you get when you buy those rights? You get the know-how of how to create the format. You get all the development process that you don't need to uh, invest in. This, these things have been worked on for years sometimes. And this process of developing the show from a core idea to a TV show takes a long time and a lot of money. This is saved from you. You don't need to invest in this. Plus, of course, the, um, the, the, the production experience, the know-how.